Good morning, Adventure Nation. We are getting ready to leave the Pio Pico RV Park. Just gonna get a little propane before we hit the road. They've got great prices here, as from what we can see from around the area. So, gonna fill that up here. Today's travel day, we're gonna leave here. We're heading back to Las Vegas. I think we're stopping in Palm Springs. That's the plan? I think so. That's the plan. So, we are gonna overnight somewhere, and we're just gonna roll the cameras and see what happens. This is the Motorhome Experiment. Just in case you guys ever wondered what hooking up a tow dolly was like, this is it. And it's as simple as that. Are you sad to be leaving Pio Pico? Not really. Ready to move on to the next thing. Not on a curve, dude. You moron. Yeah, let's wait until we cannot see anybody. Okay gang, we figured the little town of Julian here, there wasn't gonna be very many options for parking, so we figured this was our best, best option here, which is actually a pretty good option. So we should... This is the one? Mm-hmm.
It's so like picnic tables are all taken up. Traditional. Okay. I know we should get one too. Hmm? I know we should get one too. Just put it in the fridge. A pumpkin? We could do that. Alright, so Julian was an absolute zoo. It was awesome. For those of you who don't know Julian, California and what it's all about, for some reason it's the pie capital of at least the southwestern United States, if not the entire United States. Mom's apple pie, the one little store there that you saw, had probably a two hour wait for lunch. We checked across the street at Apple Alley, which is normally a little bit quicker. They were an hour, an hour and 15 minute wait. So we decided just to grab a whole pie, head back to the RV, and then just go down the road and have lunch in the RV and not kill an hour just to eat apple pie. And we found a great parking space here. It's five bucks. Just right outside town. But just a, far. what, 10 minute walk outside of town. Yeah. Uh, five bucks to park the RV, plenty of space, not gonna get stuck in that traffic. And uh, you can't beat that. Five bucks to park that thing, I'll take it. Yep. Now getting back out of here is gonna be another thing. Nice and easy. Okay, ground wasn't as soft as we thought. Oh, you're awesome, dude. Tell you what, if you like off-road toys and a lot of dust, Ocotillo Wells is the place for you. You would love this, wouldn't you, Laurie? I don't like that. <laughs> yeah, really not our thing, but if you're into the whole ATV or off-road dune buggy thing and uh, you don't mind being covered in dirt for a few days, this place out here is rocking. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna get a little sidetracked in here, as we sometimes do. And instead of going to Palm Springs, we are going to head to a place called Slab City. Slab City is a little bit of an eclectic place from what we understand, and the eclectic is something we like to check out every now and then. People on the other side are lined up for border patrol inspection coming up out of Brawley.
So you find a flat spot on the your left, look straight left. There's like road tracks. Park this thing and just walk there. Well, I think I park right here. So this place here is actually called Salvation Mountain. And as you can see, it's a pretty popular spot here. What do you think? Kind of weird? It's just weird, but cool at the same time. The VIP lounge, live music, unbelievable though. Like, look how many people live off the grid. Basically. Live off the grid. Alrighty gang, so we are here at Slab City. Slab City is just kind of south and east of the Salton Sea, south east of Palm Springs. It is a very eclectic, weird place. There are RVs boondocked everywhere here. And you can see right across the street, or you may be able to hear across the street anyways, that the Slab City VIP lounge is there playing some live music tonight. So hopefully we'll be able to get in there. I think we're VIPs. But anyways, we're gonna end it here, gang, and hopefully uh, you guys liked that video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. If you haven't been here before and you wanna keep up to date on all the stuff that we're doing, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And we'll see you guys again in another video very, very soon. Have a fantastic day.